This has to be seen in the wider context that it is a decision of the United States to leave all of the legal territorial issues arising out of Japanese aggression unresolved. It is in the interest of the United States that the countries of the uh, East Asia should be quarreling among themselves and then uh, the United States has often always been very careful to say that it is neutral between the different contestants but is willing to support any country that finds itself the subject of the use of force or aggression by China. So it's really fixing on the idea that China is a military aggressor that needs to be stopped bullying smaller countries that are largely defenseless. But there's really no point in looking at the US Filipino history except in the context of the American suppression of Filipino independence and the enormous influence America has had in shaping the whole political, economic and social structure of the Philippines. So the, really the whole history of Filipino-American relations has to be treated with a very big question mark. But I must draw the line on the insistence on the United States that strategically China is to be contained. That record is clear and it's fundamental.